35,000 students participated in the Nevada State Spelling Bee this year, but only two are headed to the Scripps National Bee next week. We caught up with Aaron Feliciano and Serena Ali at St. Viator Catholic School just days before they leave for Washington, D.C. I started to set my mind on participating in spelling bees uh, after we heard of the Tiberti spelling bee happening at Bishop Gorman's. Um, my mom and dad convinced me to try for the bee. I love words. I love reading. I love studying these words to see all the cool ways that they could be spelled. It's a lot of instinct, but I also know my roots, so I can tell from the definition, sort of. It helps uh, me find how to spell the word. I'm very nervous to be up on stage representing uh, Nevada, and if I lose, then yeah, not great for Nevada as reputation. <laughs> <laughs> I bet a lot of people right now are wishing you luck. Uh, yeah, have you been getting some kind of special attention recently over this? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know how to answer that. Just yes. So far, we have a whole list of 4,000 words, and they can ask you two of any words on those lists, so you have to learn those. Besides that, they, they're going to ask you any ran to spell any random word from the dictionary, so you have to learn a lot of stuff, for example, roots and other languages. What's seventh grade been like for you? It was fun. Um, yesterday was the last day of school, so that was exciting. It was fun. Um, I think it, I had a better time there than in sixth grade, but yeah. I like cooking, baking, reading. I like writing books. I haven't written a full book yet, but I want to start one one. Mm. If you could pick a topic for your book or a setting, what do you think it would be? Do you have an idea yet? Mm, maybe like mystery. Mm. I love mystery books. Mm. Very cool. All right, well, it's no mystery that you are a great speller. Thank you. It's official. And yeah, it's really scary. Well, not scary, it's just you get really nervous while you're up there because you can mess up at any second. I'm here with Mary Ellen DeRoe, who's headed up the spelling program here at St. Viator's for how many years now, Mary Ellen? About 25 years. I've been coaching the St. Viator team that participates in the um, Tiberti Spelling Bee at Bishop Gorman High School. So I always wonder, you know, are students given a list of words before to study or are they just study yeah, holes? They, well, they do have study words that they can go through, but the day of the bee, sometimes it's nerves or it's um, a word that maybe, you know, you can't remember all those words that you studied. And the last round is always going to be something like from the dictionary that sometimes even I can't pronounce. So okay. it's... Um, Usually it's just the studiousness of the students and they take it seriously, And but it's kind of the luck of the draw too sometimes. Best of luck to you, my friend. Yes. I'm going to be rooting for you. I'm also going to be rooting for me. Okay, yes. <laughs> the Scripps National Spelling Bee kicks off next week. Watch the two-night event next week on ION. Visit spellingbee.com for all the details.